I spoke way too soon. In fact, two episodes too soon. Because when I met Lane, I was like, oh, thank God. Vampire representation in an anime that's not a lolly. We got a MILF. This is amazing. She died. And now she's been pretty much... She became a lolly, but not really. Like, this new girl is supposed to be Lane, but she's got, like, her different set of memories. So she's her own independent person. And when she was thinking about, I think, Yogi, wasn't she blushing or something? So I feel like the lolly cons are going to win. Yet again, let's see what happens in today's reaction. Alright, we got like a fucking military SUV thing down, right? Nah, he's sleeping. Maybe he can break through it. Oh, backstory, backstory. Huh. So she names him. So this is the same girl that we meet in the facility in that like um breakout scene, right? There's like the facility, everything's like alarms are going off and she's there and then Yogi wakes up in the bus and her face kind of turns into, you know, the other girl. But like she has like a business suit on too. When you look at the flashback, it's clothing, right? And and, and and like the opening too, he lives in like a very traditional Japanese style place, you know, all this clothing, the, the architecture around this place. But she's wearing like a suit, so it looks like she's like recruiting him for something like special kids. So we're gonna bring you to this like lab to do shit. I don't know, man. Oh, Episode 5 is just called A. What is this? Omega? This is Omega, right? Episode 5 is literally just called A Omega. Is this Alpha Omega? I don't know. Asaka Takato. So we even took her last name, Takato Yogiri. We took her last name, huh? What, is, what are these lab people? Yuki or Shiraishi. <laughs> what is this? Experiments. Is Yogiri an experiment? Take care of the monster, Yogiri. Yeah, this is the room. The, the red... We saw this in the flashback. It's pretty fucking ominous, man. Looks dreadful in here. Here we go. Alpha Omega title drop again. What is it? What? Everything or eternity is Alpha Omega. Yogiri is Alpha Omega. It is Yogiri, yes. Just by thinking it, he can just end things. But he's a nice boy! Wait. They straight up hired a random teacher to literally take care of this being that can end things, just kill things by thinking? Like, these lab people just recruited a random fucking teacher? Surely she's special, right? There's like, what the fuck? This is insane! There's a possibility that humanity will perish, so I'm gonna play- I'm gonna wager all my bet on you fucking random teacher. Alright, anime logic. Okay. <laughs> Cause you're a teacher. Yeah, why her? I feel like he just saw her fucking legs and spandex and you know, the stock and was like, alright, you're in. So it's all you now, rookie. Just go, go ahead. <laughs> this is the worst first day ever, dude. <laughs> Try not to die. Imagine this is your first day at a job. And she just lets you, all right, go take care of that kid. I can just kill anything. Good luck. <laughs> that door is so ominous looking too. What was the point of this fucking door? Straight up. You have a security card. You tap it. The door opens. But... These things never matter on the front. It just looked fucking cool and deadly for no reason. Alright. It, it might as well be just a regular door that's open. Whatever. Okay, this looks cool. Whoa. Whoa! It's like a portal to a different land entirely. <laughs> this <laughs> Entrance? Road, work location. Where are you at, Alpha Omega? Hello. Yeah. Just a cute little boy. 
What? What? Oh. She's just an actually good person. Wait, 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 you sure you wanted to throw the kid that can kill anybody on the ground like this, like that? What? <laughs> Go play. Be a normal human kid. Okay, she's a great person. I like her. She's kind of ridiculous, but oh, she ne. What? There's a ghost there thing. What? Random monsters are here too? What the fuck? What the fuck? They just come here and try to kill him sometime? And remember, remember, this is outside of that isekai world that we're in right now. This is Yogiri's background. Like, this is a, like, so this has nothing to do with the world that we're familiar with so far. So I was going to be like, was that an aggressor? But it's like, no, 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 no. What happens at nighttime? <laughs> yeah, you did lose your fucking mind. No name. Sad. Before I came here, they called me Lord Okakushi. What is that reference? What does that mean? Is that important? Okay. Yes. Cook for me. Come on. You're the teacher. Okakoshi means hidden lord. <laughs> Interesting. Yo, this fridge is this the groceries is stocked up. <laughs> oh, okay, we just got a lot of shit load of instant noodles. I see, I see. Umai! Did he even have a mom? Aren't you, isn't he like a test tube baby or some shit? Your mom now. A dog? That's what he reminds you of? Kind of? What does Yogi sound uh, stand for? Is that just a dog? It's from my mom. You are mother now. Yogiri is her dog's name? Jesus Christ. I... I guess that's nice. But like, basically you're just my pet. <laughs> okay. Alright. That's how they met. Hey, this is a replay of the same scene. And we're back. Not enough, but it was enough flashback to, you know, get to understand how they started. Now, if you just say Shine, the rocks would just kind of just like destruct, right? They would just go away, right? Just like the icicles. Also, the first time he had flashbacks was when he was sleeping in the bus. It seems like every time he's just like sleeping, he has like a flashback. Is that important or just a coincidence? Yo, why are we going there again? Okay. <laughs> you really think that lady who showed up and says my power level is 520 or 30,000 and killed the other people for not laughing at a joke is gonna let us go back home? I don't think so. Yes, there may be another way. What? He can't just... Oh, 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 dragon thing? I've already killed a dragon before. This is a wyvern, actually. Easy. <laughs> Bro fell down on the side of the mountain. Oh. Just big AoE. Shine, easy. Multiple Shine, that's right, all of you die. AoE. They're just dropping like mosquitoes. <laughs> as soon as I say they look like they're dropping like fucking mosquitoes. It's a commercial for what? Bug spray? Kind of, it does. CGI Golden Thunder Dragon. Wow, but Shine. This is a cute little intermission scene. Do we know her? Yo, they did this shit last episode too because the last episode, the intermission showed the lolly vampire before we got to know her. So I guess we're gonna see her today. Okay, she got a little fang too. More fucking lollies. The lolly cons just keep fucking winning. Look at that CGI, bro. Oh, really? It's chill? You wanna be friends? You. 
did the Thunder Dragon just look at Yogi and was like, hmm, can I even fight this thing? Uh, maybe I'm just gonna run away. Okay, you pass. You're allowed to be here. Bye bye. I won't let you leave. Stop. Instant turnaround. Yeah, how the fuck are you stopping? It's alright for comedic relief. Of course. Of co I should've I should have known better. I should have known better. Of course it's gonna be the fucking lolly dude. <laughs> of course. Of course what did I think was gonna happen? How old are you? 9,000 years old? Yes, it does happen a lot on Isekai. Yeah, yeah. Right, because last episode, they mentioned the existence of not only sages, there were sword masters and mythical beasts. And I'm like, wait, are these actually important distinctions? Like what? Sword master sama, huh? Who is this dude? I want to see the sword master. I'm very interested. Yo, are they blurring out the side here because of some... Why are they blurring this shit out? Did something bad happen there? A gift of what? Yeah, I guess we're not really interested. Or you're in trouble? Rivals a sage! Okay, okay. I doubt he has information. No shot he does. Yeah, I'll show you where to go. Come with me to the Swordmaster. <laughs> See? Attila. Hello. She got a little cute little thing. She's got some fun songs. Well, she's fun, you know? She, she brings the group's mood up. All right, what is these dudes? Wait the fuck? What the fuck? Are, are these some of her classmates? I don't think so, right? I don't think so. Just basically all NPCs. I mean, he knows about a car, so he's an Isekai character, right? Well, then again, one of the cities looks pretty modern. Is that a cat girl? There's a cat- there's two cat girls here, actually. Yeah, I thought we are going to the world capital. You baited us. Here's our first fucking NPC that's gonna die by Yogiri. Shine. Oh. Oh, oh! Urabe, Swordmaster! The actual Swordmaster. Well, I don't know if he's legit, but he's kind of funny. Start killing each other until I say stop is the first thing you're gonna say. <laughs> well, we can just immediately just go shine to everybody here and everyone dies, right? I bet we might do that, yeah? Um... Uh, I feel like failing is better than risking your life and just dying here. Yeah, you really don't care. <laughs> Okay, why do I care if other people fail? Fuck it, let's just walk out. But as we walk out, maybe the people, the NPC starts attacking us, say, No, I need to pass! And then go Shine. And then we kill them all and we somehow just like pass because we're the only one left. We killed everyone, right? Come on, start killing. Oh no! NPCs are dying! Yeah, look at these NPCs, dude. Shine. Oh? We got a knight? Our hero! Huh? Hey, he seems like a pretty decent guy, yeah. Is he a classmate? What the fuck? Is a mage group? Where did they come from? Are they all part of the, 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 the test too? Okay. Uh, instant death. Don't worry about it. Oh, he's very stupid too. But yeah, at least he's nice. He's stupid, but he's nice. Yeah, sure. <laughs> sure, I guess. He's so nice. <laughs> what is this blur, dude? We're not watching Jav right now. What you, what's going on? Rainbow color stone. It heals you? No. Apology stone. So he got cut in half. And he says, This is an apology stare! And then he's back to normal? What the fuck is his power? <laughs> Don't even bother explaining it. Sure, it's fine. I mean, that's what I expect from this show, anyways. They just douche and don't explain something. It's like, alright. I'm sure we'll learn later. Yeah, you said we're gonna be able to go home. So she just wants the fucking cloud chase. She just wants someone really good to be the divine nut so she can be just a follower. What happens if she becomes a follower though? What privilege does she get? 
Hello, Rick. Rick. Alright. <laughs> or that is what you can call me while we're here. Is he an actual incognito idol? What's going on? I don't care about your name. What what does that rock do, dude? What does that rock do? Also, yeah, what is a divine knight, king? What is this shit? The gods who have sealed away, or what we call God, they're demons. So gods and demons, they're kind of sin like they're the same shit, except the gods have been sealed away are demons. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. The dark god was sealed away by the divine king. Wait, let's see this. The divine king looks like a waifu here, right? 100%, that's a waifu. So it looks like she stabs herself too, right? She got close to him. She stabs him in the back, but then somehow it penetrates her too. Okay. The spawn of the dark god. How does this relate to the aggressors and the sages? Okay. So I can try my luck with the gacha pull and stuff. I, 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 I received as an apology. It can heal me from a serious injury, but then how do you jump to the next thing you say? And I can try my luck with gacha pull and stuff. So these gems are used for gacha? The bro was playing fake grand order, and then the, the patch, the update was delayed, so he got apology gems. And now these gems are average Genshin Impact player? <laughs> You think, you think Hoyoverse is gonna give you apology gems for fucking getting a delay on the Genshin Impact? No, no. They're gonna give you fucking three mints and fucking 5,000 more and say, fuck you, you better enjoy this shit. <laughs> what, what's, what's going on? Unlucky dude. Okay. That's... What? I'm confused. He's just a gacha player. Okay. So he's an actual isekai character where he got some, but like the gives a goddess. Like he actually got a goddess to like give him powers. So the goddess gave him these apology gems for being sacrificed. <laughs> a goddess appeared and I got an apology stone for being sa so, so he's Bro's living his own different isekai show by himself. He's got his own Megami, okay? She's the guardian spirit for us, right? Gambling over 2D waifus. Basically, you're single and you can't get bitches, but you're also so busy working 9 to 5. So what do you do? How do you fill the void in your heart? You play mobile games that's intended to autoplay for you, but at the same time, you spend money to get a chance for 2D waifus. That's right. Not a guarantee. Just because you spend $100 on some pulls doesn't mean you're going to guarantee it. It's a 0.01% chance to get the waifu. And sometimes there's a 50-50, meaning even if you get that rare pull, that 0.01%, there's a 50-50 chance that you might not get the waifu that you wanted. And you might get a fucking fat, ugly bastard. <laughs> what is this? He just did one pull. What is this shit? Normal scrub brush. Fucking two star pull. His entire theme is a gacha player. I love him. So the unluckier he gets, the more gems he gets. Dude, this shit's hilarious. This guy suddenly became one of my favorite characters. <laughs> okay. Whoa. Hey, we're Damachi Tower now. Or maybe this is Tower of God Tower. I don't know. Walk away? Why, why, why? No? <laughs> why are you puking? That's okay though, because that means he's going to get more pulls. More unlucky shit happens, the more pulls he gets. Oh, and Yogiri probably doesn't get affected by it all. Why does it... Oh, more pulls, baby! <laughs> Easy. Bro, just got my ass for resistance. Dude is literally fucking a dream Uru, dude, or fucking, you know, the, the spider anime we're watching right now. You just get beat up by something, you get burnt. Oh no! I'm burnt up! Apology Stone comes in, fire resistance, and he gets healed up. This bro is fucking busted. He straight up survived after being cleaved in half. This guy's actually insane. Yogiri, I guess it just doesn't affect him because he's Alpha Omega. I don't know. The miasma dissipated because did he just 
kill the miasma? I don't know. Oh, she couldn't enter? Yo, this is turning into like a fucking entrance exam mark. I'm all down. This is hype. This is getting actually really good. I love settings like this. Like a cohort of groups trying to do like an entrance exam. All new characters. It's very high up. It's end of the world. Man. Hey! That's the fucking, uh, we just talked about it. The demon and the, the, what was it? The fucking, uh, who was it again? The divine king or something? Right. That's what we saw in the flashback. That's the ceiling. The sword master and the dark god. Sorry, is a sword master, is a sword master and a divine king different things? Sorry. I, I thought that the divine king was the one that was sealing and managing the, uh, knights of the divine king. So knights are the sword masters. I'm just confused. Is, is the sword master the same thing as the divine king? Or is the divine king a king that resides over multiple sword masters? And that was one sword master that sealed, that was fighting the dark god. And I don't, I'm confused. What did you just say? A sword master is nothing but a what? A sword master amounts to nothing more than a lookout. What? So they're not really important? I am more confused the more I read this shit. Frederica. All right, Frederica. Who is she? I don't think she can. Are you really her? You're talking to the sword master and you're talking big. Ah, is she actually good? Is she she's acting kind of chuny too? Maybe she's competent, maybe she's not. Sunbasto Freya, but nothing. No, of course not. It's not enough. Time flows slowly. Oh, what the fuck? Well, Yogiri would be very good at this. He just kind of end this concept and it would just all go away. And, and then what? I guess we get the, the dark god. Would Yogi. If we end it, would Yogiri technically unseal the dark god? Right? It's just like if he like killed whatever this purple bubble is that, you know, flow of time and stuff, and then there's the sword master and the dark god. If Yogiri just ends it, wouldn't the dark god get like resurrected? All right, back to the night selection. All right, whatever. Ooh, who are you? Okay. Yeah, can you just do that? Can you just jump? You need to get 100 points and get to the bottom of the tower in 24 hours. Yeah, that's the first time I'm seeing her, but she's she's really nice too. Ooh. <laughs> this guy's gonna be definitely a piece of shit, right? I mean, how many other guys have we seen where they just kind of had a harm and they just were kind of just trash, right? I don't know, man. Wait, this girl looks pretty interesting. Not this guy. Not this guy. Adi Furata wannabe. <laughs> this is UA? Sorry. The little girl of UA? This is, um, uh, me, uh, uh, fuck. Bunny girl? UA? Yeah, fuck, fuck. Bunny girl. But, but, but you, you know what I'm saying. Lonely vampire, bunny girl, and the tall girl. Ah, uh, we, we don't really have one. Shea, that's right. My bad, my bad. This girl, though, with the braids. Okay, she seems pretty interesting just because she's wearing, like, a hoodie. Where is he? What's up? Why are you worried? He killed the miasma. But when killing the miasma, where is the source of the miasma? Is it that purple thing? So did he already... Is the demon god... Is the dark god already being unsealed right now? Because it's, it's slowly taking effect of killing it? What, what, what did you do? What did you do? We'll figure it out next episode. This is a very interesting start of an arc. Like... I had no idea what the fuck we're going to do, but then immediately we get a backstory with Takato, and this is fucking ridiculous. This is a human research center. And they're like, hey, random teacher, we got this thing that can just kill things on an instant by thinking about it. You should just go teach it. Okay, Mr. Science Man. She's a nice person. I really like this Takato person. Interesting that she he only gets these flashbacks when he sleeps. I'm not sure if that's actually important. Also, she named this after her dog. Yogiri is her dog's name. It is what it is. Now, there is this new uh, Swordmaster thing. I I'm a little confused because, you know, so this exam is to like become a Swordmaster, which then I don't know. I honestly don't know.
I also don't know. We're like becoming the Knights of the Divine King, but then there's also called Swordmaster too. Maybe a translation issue. Regardless, it seems like a pretty interesting fight. Uh, a pretty interesting arc, right? We got Rick, who's seemingly some really cool knight that might be an incognito celebrity. We got Mr. Gacha player, Liney, right? This dude, already, I love him. His entire theme is just gotcha. And because I'm a degenerate gambling addict that loves gotcha games, he fits exactly into the power that, you know, I would find very interesting in a show like this. And finally, when we got to this tower, the goal is to basically get that while collecting 100 points. But there's also this source of, I don't know, there's like a sword master in there and there's a dark god. So they were talking about how the dark god was like sealed away a long time ago, right? This is the seal. But if the seal was also producing the miasma, right? And if Yogiri ended the miasma before, isn't this slowly becoming undone right now? I don't really know, but next couple episodes, I have a good feeling. This is gonna be great. Also, didn't we fucking talk about some kind of satellite and opening of a gate last episode with the other classmates? What did that happen? Whatever. But hey, if you're still here, if you did enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.